What's going on everybody? Steve here, Rake and Profit. Had a viewer question that had come in on my uh, Facebook recently and it was asking, Steve, if I wanna go full-time selling on eBay, how many times a day do I have to go to the thrift store? So this person that was watching was just getting started. I believe they were flipping items on eBay for like 60 or 90 days. They're having some good results, but they were working a full-time job and they wanna transition over to you know, full-time on eBay and eventually quit their job. So they're asking, how often do I have to go to the thrift store? Do I have to go every day, every other day, twice a day? What's worked best for you? So for me personally, well, let me, let me start, start off with this. It depends where you live, right? Um, you know, where we are in Connecticut, every Sunday there's a half off sale, so all the colors change. So that's a great day to go in and kind of scoop up stuff, 50% off. At Sabres, once a month or so we have sales, so like I definitely hit those. Salvation Army in our area, we used to have fill a bag days and like different things that were going on. So I would most importantly hit up the sales. The sales are the most important, but besides that, how often do you go? For me personally, I like to go every single day, especially when I was full time. Right now I'm part time and I've got so many things going on. So there's sometimes there's weeks I don't even go to the thrift store because I'm like focusing on the YouTube or I'm focusing on books or private labels. So for me it's different. But when I was full time, guys, remember there was a point where I was full time, 100% eBay. That's all I was doing. I had a warehouse, I had employees. I was going out every single day. Now, I do the best when I go out twice a day to my specific honey holes. And you might be thinking, Steve, what the heck's a honey hole? A honey hole is, and we all have them, depending on where you live, we all have one or two thrift stores that tend to do the best. Maybe it's because we know them the most, or maybe it's just a good opportunity. But I like to go to the honey holes at least twice a day because there's always new inventory that's coming out. There's inventory that comes out in the morning, afternoon, and at night. So if you only come at night, there's gonna be certain resellers that come in during the day and afternoon that are gonna swoop up the profits and you know, vice versa. So twice a day was optimal. Um, there's this one good Goodwill in my area that I like to go to after the gym almost every day and they're always like wheeling out new inventory. So personally for me, you know, going every single day is key to kind of like being able to go full time and get enough inventory. But I have seen some people who only go out like three times a week and what they do is they go hard. They hit the pavement for like 10, 12 hours a day. So they'll make a map of like 10 or 15 thrift stores and just kind of swoop through them. And they've gotten away with that twice, three times a week. But if you're like me and you're only going to like one, two, three, three, thrift stores a day in your area. Um, I like to go every day anywhere between 30 minutes to an hour and a half to two hours. So that's kind of what's worked for me when I was full time. If you're part time, you know, just pop in and out, you know, one, two thrift stores a day for 10, 15 minutes. And you could definitely make a thousand bucks a month, 1500 bucks a month, just kind of popping in. But it depends where you live. It depends how much inventory you need. It depends how many sales you have running in your area and how many opportunities and how much competition you have. But typically, I would say in general, go every day if you can for at least an hour sourcing. That's going to be a really good place to start to be able to get enough inventory to go full time. So hopefully this video helped. Guys, if you enjoyed it, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And please leave a comment below. How often do you go sourcing? For you to go full time, how many times a week did you have to go? How many hours did you have to spend? Let me know in the comments, guys. Peace.